So hey, Ben, it's Jamie. That's me here. Welcome back to my channel, honey, and welcome back to yet another news chat. Okay, please keep in mind that news chats are on my current channel. Be sure if you're in, if you are enjoying this type of content, be sure to go and follow my other page. That's me, Jamie. Okay, once I get that page up and running, I will be moving my news content over on that channel. So if you want to stay in the know, be sure to go over there and follow. That's me. Jamie. Okay, let's go ahead and get into some things because I do have a story for you guys, okay, regarding an Atlanta rapper that ended up being taken out of this world by his brother. And I'm trying to remember what it is that, um, oh, I think he did the song, We Read It. Uh -huh. Uh, we read it. I think that was his song. Okay. So his name happens to be Archie Eversoul and he lived in Atlanta. He was an Atlanta rapper. And according to this headline over here on Daily Mail, they're saying that Atlanta rapper Archie Eversoul's brother is now charged with his death after the We Ready uh, rapper was pow, pow, pow down okay they're saying that ever soul who was 37 years old was found with a wound at a chevron gas station just east of atlanta girl not over in east atlanta on march 25th okay now he ended up being pow 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 he went into the hospital shortly thereafter on april 3rd was when he ended up passing away all right now let's keep going they're saying that the rapper's brother alexander cross who happens to be 41 years old was charged on thursday now, he was initially charged with aggravated assault in possession of more than an ounce of marijuana. Now, a motive for the uh, popping, okay, I'm trying not to say the word, girl, you know how YouTube do, girl. Anyway, um, a motive for the capping remained unknown to police as well as the nature of the relationship of the two brothers because of their different last names. And now, since February, Eversoul posted cryptic messages on Instagram suggesting that he was dealing with issues of trust okay other people who had hurt him before okay so he was dealing with issues of trust he put up a post saying you can f up a whole bond by lying to someone you could have told the truth to ever so said this five weeks prior before being pop pop popped okay ever so was uh age 17 when he recorded his debut album ride with me a dirty south style which was released in 2000 Two, okay, the album featured his anthem We Ready, which has become a very popular hype song at sports stadiums um, among athletes. Girl, I wonder and hope that he was getting some type of residuals or some checks from sync licensing since people were out here using his music. Girl, I want to believe that he didn't because a lot of people that came up in the late 90s, early 2000s really got played when it came down to, you know, um, the music world and stuff. People are now becoming more woke and more wise. But yeah, um, it's just so unfortunate that he was taken out of this world because to me, 37 years old is extremely young. 36, 37, girl, he around the age of me. You know, extremely young. And... um extremely uh unfortunate that it happened to be his brother okay girl i hate to see it they're saying the brother of author archie ever so known for the we ready anthem often played at nfl games they're talking about that they're saying that he was arrested okay ever so was found with a wound at chevron gas station just east of atlanta okay i need to know more details i need to know like what was the cause what happened that caused you to want to take on this type of direction when it came to your brother okay they're saying cross like i told you guys earlier was charged with possession of marijuana he is being held without bail okay over in decap county police have not revealed any motive for the capping or the relationship between the brothers okay i don't know if they had the same mom because you know a lot of people have the same mom different last names or if they just had the same dad different moms what the cause was that led to him deciding that he was going to cap his brother. I just feel like it don't matter how, everybody's different, but I just feel like it don't matter how mad I get with my brothers or my, my siblings or whatever, I'm not going to go to the approach where I decide that I'm going to remove one from this world. Like, and I, I don't know um, if Archie had any children, but that sucks that you are the uncle and if he does have children, you took them, took him away from his kids and proud and about took yourself from your kids if you do have children. It's a very unfortunate situation, okay? So we still do not have details as to 
why he did this. And I can't wait till they get more details. What else are they saying? They say Eversoul shared a Twitter post written by comedian Lil Duval back in February, a little more than a month before his passing. If you feel like your friends are supporting strangers more than they support you, become a stranger. Oh, wow. Oh, my. Girl, y'all might need to become a stranger. Listen, I felt like that was a little word there, girl. If y'all got some friends out here that ain't supporting you, but they'll support a stranger. Because let me tell you one thing about it. You're going to get more su support from people you don't know than the people you do know. Girl, you might want to become a stranger. But anyway, in another Instagram post shared just days before the incident took place, the rapper wrote, you can F up a whole bond by lying to someone you could have just told the truth to. So I don't know if his brother could have did something sideways, girl. Um, but I want to know more details as to why um, his brother, Mr. Alexander, decided to take this route. Uh, let's see what else. If they're giving us anything new, they're not giving us anything new in this particular article. But I am going to do just another quick search real quick just to see if any more details have popped out of the sky to gain some insight as to why the brother um, decided that he wanted to take this route. Uh, mother manager insists the brother is not responsible. Oh, wow. Let's click, click on this. Let's click on this. So they're saying that the brother is not responsible for the incident. Okay. Archie ever um, surrounding his death. The mother's uh, manager insists brother is not responsible for harming his brother. The mother of Archie Eversole, best known for the 2002 song We Ready, Alexander Cross, is currently being charged. Okay, the mother of both men. Wow. So this is the mom of both guys. So they have the same mom. Maybe different dads based on the last names, possibly. Um, wow. She says, uh, the mother of both men says she's too devastated to talk about the passing publicly. She says, uh, Archie Eversole's manager, John Williams, got his permission to record a private video explaining why she thinks Cross is innocent. Okay. They had no arguments. They had no feuds. Okay. No. And I know that yesterday I talked to the neighbor next door. I asked her and I say, did you hear any arguments? Did you hear any fights? She said, no, she didn't hear nothing. Not that day, not any other day. So the brother's obviously had no friction according to the mom now they're saying the family feels not an, um the family feels not enough was done to save archie's life okay he passed away on april 3rd nine days after the shooting from a blood loss girl not him laying up in the hospital and he passed because of blood loss like yeah girl what was y'all doing okay was he just bleeding out because y'all like girl what hospital did he go to this is very sad what hospital did he go to and why could y'all you know what I'm saying? Um, they're talking about, okay, who is Alexander Cross? Alexander Cross is accused of pow powing and taking out his brother, Arch the, uh, Archie, okay? The mother of both men said she's too devastated to talk about it. We got into that. She said that there were no arguments. The neighbor said that there were no arguments or anything between the two guys. Um, very unfortunate situation. I do wonder now, one, if he did do this, why did you do it? And two, if he did not do this, what evidence that the police have that made them so compelled to charge the brother with the passing okay um that's what i would like to know okay if you guys have any details or anything regarding this particular situation go ahead and hop down in the comments and let me know your thoughts as i've already said the mother does not believe her son mr alexander had anything to do with the passing of her other son mr archie because they never got into arguments ever okay so there's that that's all that i have honey i'm jamie that's me don't forget to like comment subscribe share my videos follow me on instagram and twitter at jamie that's me and i'll catch you guys in the next one Bye-bye.